Hello, my name is Mohammed with South Warrior. Safety, efficiency, and productivity are essential in the use and maintenance of South Warrior contractor equipment. And today we are going to be talking about the inspection and operation of your simple rail maneuverable payoff system. Let's get started with the inspection and then we will move into operation. First, inspect the simple reel to ensure that overall condition of the payoff system is satisfactory and there is no visible damage to the reel or missing parts which will affect the operation and safety at your job site. Then, make sure all four chocks are attached to the flanges where indicated. Check the side of the reel and identify that proper labeling and packing list is on the flanges. Please note that most previously inaccessible areas on job sites are accessible now. For example, doorways, hallways, elevators. Now let's move on to using your simple reel at feed location. First, locate the arrow sticker attached to your wire on the reel to identify the direction that your simple reel is paying off. For horizontal and underground pulls, pay off cable from the top. For overhead pulls, pay off the cable from underneath. Confirm the tagged plastic label printed on your wire, which contains the name of the reel as well as cable type, size and length matches your order. Roll the simple reel as close as possible to where you are feeding the wire. Place all four chocks between the reel and the ground when putting cables and or storing a simple reel. Locate the green circle labeled rip chip. Pull the pink string one direction until it's tight, then pull back at the opposite direction so it cuts through the plastic wrap cleanly. If your order includes pulling heads, locate the beginning of the pull by looking for the white foam. The pulling head will be tied together with a rope. Cut this rope with a pair of side cutting pliers or similar pliers to free the heads. Please note that there might be two tie ropes and you should not start pulling the cable until both are freed. Look for another rope tie about 10 feet after the heads. Cut it and remove the tape, if any. During your pull, release the drag by turning the tension knob counterclockwise. If the reel starts to over-rotate, turn it clockwise to tighten. Adjust your tension accordingly when pulling Please note that tension adjuster is not the brake mechanism, but only for adjusting the reel's back tension and its speed. You have now completed your preliminary inspection and executed your pull. We hope that this video has been helpful to you and provided some knowledge on the use of your simple reel. For more information about this product and more, visit southward.com today.